Um, today I am going to unbox not one, not two, but three envelopes from Scentbird. I've been kind of like hoarding these. Um, we've got June, no, I think we've got May, June. Uh, we skipped July because of a billing issue. I forgot to um, give them my updated credit card information. It expired. And then August. So um, I'm not sure which one is which. It doesn't really matter um, because they don't send everybody the same one. You get to choose um, which perfume that you want. You put it in your queue um, up to like months in advance. And I chose mine like when I first um, joined, which was months ago. Um, so I don't really remember everything that was in my queue and it looks like this month okay when you first join your first month they give you the atomizer with the velvet pouch um and then with the perfume inside it you just twist it up and it comes out and then you just pull it out and then from every month after that they give you this vial in a little cardboard tube so i'm not sure why I got, I'm not complaining, I'm down with it. Maybe it was because I skipped to July, so maybe they're considering me a new customer. I don't know. Anyways, so, that smells pretty good. What is this one? Yves Saint Laurent Black Opium, which is a classic. I don't think I want to spray all of them because that'll be like a weird mix of fragrances, but yeah, that's a good one. I don't know why I'm whispering. Moving on to the next one. Yeah, see, cardboard tube is what it usually comes in after you get your first shipment. So, this one is Nina Ricci, Mademoiselle Ricci. Mmm, that's nice. It's very light. 